hey guys welcome back to the channel so in this question we have uh this beam that we need to determine the reaction at a and in the b part of the question we need to find the tension in the cable so we're going to start as always with the free body diagram and obviously we are in equilibrium so we have our equilibrium equations which are sum of all forces in x and y direction equals zero and some of the moments uh, about any point in here equals zero to so let's show all the forces that we have on the free body diagram first so we have uh the 15 pounds in here we have the 20 pounds we have 35 so at point a we have 20 pounds and at, at point b we have 15 pounds force and at point a we have a pen which means um the motion is restricted in x and y direction so we'll consider both x and y at point a at the end of the beam at point b we have a cable that is attached to the beam uh, we have all the information about the distances that's pretty much for all the forces we can start with our equilibrium equation and first of all the easiest one seems to be the x so let's start with the fx first and this would be our positive direction for x looking at the free body diagram we'll see that only ax is the force in x direction and that would be all for our x meaning that there is no reaction in x direction uh, now we can move on to our moment equation we can go either with point a or point b uh, let's do the point b counterclockwise positive and we're going to use the 2d shortcut that we have for finding the moment i'm going to put the link down below in case you guys want to check it out so let's start with the moment of the 15 pounds force so looking at that we'll see that the uh, all the forces on the left side that are downward are going to make a counterclockwise moment which is positive so we have 15 times the distance will be uh, what we have from here to here so from the point that we are finding the moment about to the line of action which will be 8 plus 6 plus 8 plus 6 and this will give us 28 and let's move on to the 20 pounds again we have a positive moment 20 times that would be 6 plus 8 plus 8 this would give us 22 and let's move on to the 35 again a positive moment and distance will be 6 plus 8 which is 14 and we have another 20 pounds force the one in here and the distance will be simply 6 and we have the moment of ay and if we look at this we'll see that ay is going to make moment in the opposite direction which is clockwise so we have a negative sign in here and distance will be six this will be equal zero and the only unknown in here is a y which would be another reaction at point a and this will be 245 pounds we didn't get any negative sign that shows that that was the correct direction for a y and uh, we can do now either the moment about point A or doing the sum of all forces in Y direction, which seems to be easier. This is our positive direction. We we'll simply have AY minus FBC, which is the tension in the cable, minus 15, minus 20, 35, 20, and 15. Uh, so we have AY 245 minus fbc minus 105 equals zero and from here we can find our fbc or the tension in the cable 140 pounds and obviously the direction was correct because a cable can only be in tension it cannot be in compression so uh, we know at the beginning that this is the correct direction for the cable and that would be all for this question please make sure to subscribe to the channel it's going to help me to reach out to more students who need some help with uh, these problems and you guys take care and i'll see you in the next video mm -hmm.